My name is Morgan, I'm 21 years old. I'm from San Jose, California, and I'm currently a student at San Jose State University. My senior year of high school, I auditioned for the San Francisco 49er cheerleaders, and you know, on a whim, and I made it out of around 500 girls. There was about nine spots available, and so I was young, but it was a lot of fun. Once I started college, I realized <laughs> this is a lot to handle, so. You know, school unfortunately has to be the number one. I can't have all the fun cheerleading. <laughs> I feel like my outer appearance can sometimes, I mean, it's, I think it's detrimental in this game. In real life, I don't, I think it's to an advantage, but here in Survivor, cuter young girls, they're usually first to go. People don't really want to put up with them. They usually aren't a big help, and they just sort of follow around the other males, so. I hope to kind of break that mold and be completely different because I'm definitely not a follower. I'm more of a leader. My strategy in the beginning is just really, this sounds kind of bad, but just like the middle of the road, ho-hum people, they're not the worst, they're not the best. They kind of just slide through in the beginning. And I feel like, you know, that could help me to align with them in the beginning. You know, I'll definitely be nice to the guys. I don't feel like I'll have a problem you know, being their friend and close friend, but following them around the whole time is just so not me. As I say what's on my mind, I really don't hold anything back, and I feel like if you're gonna succeed in this, you know, show and in this environment, you really have to have that type of personality. People who are shy and timid usually don't get too far, and people who are afraid to be cutthroat and be deceitful, you know, they don't get too far either. It's the people that really, really don't have a conscience, I feel, that can get farther in this game. Here, I have no problem in, you know, doing whatever it takes to get me farther. Who cares about everyone else?